Hello, I hope you had a fantastic time celebrating VE Day on Friday and also that you had a wonderful weekend. Today we are going to read chapter 10 of Peter Pan. It's called The Fight on the Pirate Ship. But let's just have a think about what happened at the end of chapter 9. We left Peter Pan on his way to try and rescue Wendy, the lost boys, and also John and Michael, who'd been captured by the evil Captain Hook and his evil pirate crew. Let's see what happens. Chapter 10. The Fight on the Pirate Ship. Aboard the Jolly Roger, Hook had the boys dragged up from the hold. He promised to spare two of them if they would join the crew. Would we be free subjects of the king? asked John bravely. You would have to swear. Down with the king, growled Hook. Then we say no, was the answer. Bring out the plank, roared Hook, and fetch their mother. Wendy was brought up to see her boys walk to their death in the briny ocean. Have you any last message for your children, sneered Hook. Wendy spoke out firmly. All your mothers hope you will die bravely like true Englishmen. Tie her to the mast, Hook screamed. The boy's eyes were on the plank. It was the last walk they would ever take. There was a grim silence, but it was broken by a strange sound. The d -d -d of the crocodile. Hook collapsed with fear. He crawled along the deck, crying to his men, Hide me! Hide me! As the crew gathered round Hook, the boys looked over the side and saw, not the crocodile, but Peter Pan. And here is a picture of what is happening. We have Captain Hook with his evil pirates forcing the boys to walk the plank. We have Wendy tied up and Peter Pan is carefully climbing aboard the ship. I wonder what's going to happen next. He was ticking, signalling to the boys not to give him away. He slipped aboard and ran to hide in the captain's cabin. When the ticking stopped, Hook grew brave again. He lined up the boys for a flogging and sent Jukes to his cabin for the cat o' nine tails. Jukes entered the dark room. Suddenly there was a terrible scream. A blood-curdling crow followed. Jukes had been killed by Peter. Two more pirates suffered the same fate. After this, the crew lost their nerve and no one else would venture forth. So Hook sent in the eight boys. Let them kill each other, he snarled. This was just what Peter wanted. He unlocked the boys' chains with a key he had found and armed them with Hook's weapons. Then, while the pirates' backs were turned, they all crept out on deck. Peter freed Wendy and, wrapping himself in her cloak, took her place at the mast. Then he let out a terrific cock a doo doo The pirates, frightened out of their wits, spun round. "'Tis an unlucky ship!' they cried. "'That has a captain with a hook!' "'Tis because we have a woman on board,' said Hook quickly. "'Fling her over the side!' "'No one can save you now, Missy,' said one of the kinder pirates sadly. "'Here's one who can,' cried Peter, throwing aside the cloak. "'Peter Pan!' A great fight began. Swords and cutlasses clashed, and bodies tumbled into the water. Soon only Hook was left. His sword flashed like a circle of fire. Leave him to me, boys, cried Peter. Although he was smaller, Peter was nimbler and soon wounded Hook. At the sight of his own blood, Hook turned pale and dropped his sword. He rushed to set fire to the powder magazine and blow the ship up. But Peter bravely snatched the torch from his hand and threw it into the sea. Hook backed away from the menacing Peter and climbed on the bulwark. Peter aimed a kick at him, and Hook lost his balance, slithering straight down into the sea. The crocodile, whose clock had run down at last, had silently followed Peter and was waiting patiently below. As Hook reached the water, the crocodile opened his jaws, 
and finally had the rest of Hook for his supper. Here are our comprehension questions for chapter 10. Why did the boys not join Captain Hook's crew? What is Wendy's message to the children? True or false, the crocodile came onto the ship. What happened to the pirates? Why does Captain Hook think that the ship is unlucky? What does the word nimbler mean? How did Captain Hook die? As always, it'd be wonderful if you could post your work either on my Twitter page or the Clifton Twitter page. Well, thank you for listening and please join me tomorrow for chapter 11 of Peter Pan. It's called The Return Home. I'll see you then.